This presentation will introduce the State University of New York Exploring Emerging Technologies for Lifelong Learning and Success. The URL for this project is suny.edu slash emtech. In today's environment, there are so many choices. The number of emerging technologies keeps growing and changing. The tools vary in their purpose and also in the quality. How do we know which is best to choose? We hope to address that through the use of MTech MOOC. It's a discovery learning opportunity to explore and reflect on innovative and creative uses of emerging technologies. This learning opportunity is targeted to all learners, anybody who has an interest to stay current with today's rapidly changing technologies. It's especially well suited for students and instructors. The project comes in two parts. One part is MTech MOOC. The MOOC is a massive open online course provided through the Coursera platform. It provides a supportive online learning opportunity. The other part of the project, which we will discuss most in this presentation, is MTech Wiki. It is a socially curated repository of freely available technology tools, tutorials, and resources. These resources are used in MTech MOOC to complete the assignments. If you come to the Wiki from the MOOC, you are automatically directed to the module that you're coming from. Across the middle of the screen, you see the banner for lifelong learning, communication and collaboration, creativity and critical thinking. These match up to the modules within the MOOC. So if you come to the wiki from the second module, which is communication and collaboration, automatically the wiki filters down the 500 plus resources that are contained within the wiki and shows you just the ones that are relevant to communication and collaboration. You can narrow your selection further using the filters on the side. For example, you can choose from objectives, such as raise awareness or share information. You can also choose by the technology categories, audio, gamification, open educational resources, productivity tools, simulations, and others. This is a wiki, so you can also contribute to the wiki. This crowdsourced collection has grown from 150 original resources. The learning process of MTech is to first read and view and participate with course materials in Coursera. You're then asked to explore the wiki tools and resources to complete the discovery exercises. You then explore the tools and create an artifact and reflect in an ePortfolio. Finally, you earn badges and a Coursera certificate. So the rewards for participating include the development of a personal ePortfolio, digital badges, a Coursera certificate, and the intrinsic rewards of being a lifelong learner. This map shows the reach of MTech. We are very close to 30,000 learners. The circles on the map show the size of the target audience. So for example, India has quite a few, Mexico, and the biggest group is over the New York State where SUNY is located. Accessible learning for all. What a concept. That's the idea that we hope to promote through MTech Wiki and MTech MOOC. Thank you, and if you have any questions, please reach out to us at mtechmook at gmail.com.